Hey guys, uh, welcome back. Today we're gonna be talking about how you can record and play video uh, inside the photo library. You need to know that you can find source code of this project in GitHub, in our GitHub, and also you can find link to that source code inside uh, you know our below comment. Let's start our project. You really need the, the source code to make sure that find that link and going over that. So yeah, let's go to our Xcode to starting project. But uh, before that, I will uh, show you that you know this will be our output uh, when you tap on record trigger. Uh, you know recording the camera user interface and when you tap on play um, uh, trigger playing. And here I'll show you sample record. Yeah, you will see that you know we trigger you know this uh, interface. Then we do our recording. You will see here now it's recording. When done, it will be reviewable there. And then after we review, then find it's good then we can go and then this time we will go for play video and then we will pick up that video and we will watch it or we can we can do whatever we want with it so yeah this was uh, for doing this part uh, yeah so uh, let's me start the project uh, I'm gonna stop this uh, and also I'm gonna close it because uh, it will be override so close this project yep so what I do I say file new project so single view app iOS Swift video record and play and yeah I'm gonna write it in the final iOS Swift project you say is it exists you want to ex replace it yes I'm gonna replace it with brand new so because I don't want to miss this part which is very important first of all I'm gonna go to info p list and I will add three privacy there. So info police, we need to add three privacy. One, I select this one, one, two, two, and three. Okay. What's four? I'm gonna yeah, I'm gonna delete this one. So yeah, I'll go here, then I say privacy. Which privacy? First of all, we can pick up, let's see which one coming, yeah, library. So first of all, we pick up this, photo library addition. And then we will pick up privacy for camera and uh, microphone so let me find the first one one of them video usage so video usage yeah camera usage and this one will be for privacy for microphone usage okay so when you know I copy this identifier I put in all of them and then I say use library this one I say use camera and this one I say use make so let's Make it this one cam. 
to be all three okay so this is the first thing we need to do after the, this uh, we will go to our main storyboard and we start to make an you know our interface <coughs> and we make it easy so two button one here but I go to size inspector and in size inspector I'll say yeah 200 byte and 200 high then I'll go to attribute inspector and over here I said text yellow uh, font something between 20 and 30 and then for background we use red also I need to make this record video okay so also I add two constraint to keep same wide and high in any situation okay so then I command C command V I make a copy of that Yeah, I need to make a copy of that. Let's see. Yeah. So I select this uh, record video, command C, and then command V. Here you go. So I bring this down. a little bit slow so calm down please okay it's calm down so what I gonna do I just uh, choose this one then I say instead of record I say play enter and then for text color a background color I make it blue Okay, so I come, I push command and select this one as well. <coughs> Excuse me, and then uh, I go to editor, embed in, stack view. So in a stack view, I just add some spacing there between these two. Okay. I was good enough okay now I'm gonna say align this for me horizontally and vertically in middle okay so it will be good now in different devices okay so uh, now I'll go to my view controller to speed up and make this uh, video shorter so I uh, you know use pre-type uh, code so first of all I'm gonna go here and say import AV kit also import mobile core services also I need to extend this uh, you know I, with two uh, super classes one for UI image picker controller delegate and the other one UI navigation controller delegate okay so I add this to super uh, you know view uh, actually my, yeah super class uh, to make my view class subclass of them and inherit and uh, you know all of the methods from them then uh, here I just need to add two variable these two variables for when we gonna video and when we gonna play our video so not for recording for recording I'll tell you when it's gonna start when close when done 
okay so uh, video and image review okay this one will be UI image picker controller it will be instance of this and also the other one where video capital URL type URL question mark yeah so this is two variable we need to create in view did load we do nothing so we just work with those two uh, functions so uh, let me go here and now pick up uh, you know this pre-typed code then when we run the uh, project I'll explain to you okay so uh, yeah we copy paste that part here and now our project is ready for running so I start to running that then oh sorry sorry, sorry. I missed most important part so I need to connect this to action IB actions to these buttons so let's let's try to see you know in usual way we can open assistant editor and then we can connect with control drag but uh, I, I want to do something different so I select this one then I click right click here so uh, so I your let me select one of these buttons and right click so you will see uh, I will have two new action I suppose to have I don't have it so uh, let me go and open assistant editor to do this connection and don't waste time and uh, in other video I will show you actually I will make a video specifically for that to show you how without opening assistant editor you can connect okay so uh, yeah here I'll come from here record action so I go over record video and for this one for IB action uh, for play I just connect this to play so that's it we done with connection so let's run project and then see if it's working fine so I run this and yeah now I explain to you so uh, what we did we import AV kit mobile and then we extend our class to be subclass of this too then we start recording from here so you will see that you tap on uh, record button and trigger this one so this one will check if you uh, this source code is available camera if it's available go for it. if not just message that there's cam not camera if it's go for it, we will create a image picker which is a, an instance from UI image picker controller interface so and then we make delegate safe and source camera built succeed I love this and uh, media type uh, small k u t t actually UT type movie as a string and then we make editing uh, allow editing false and then we present it okay so we present it we do whatever we like and we do record and record and then after we done uh, we uh, you know can hear control that uh, you know that part uh, that uh, actually image picker controller and uh, if uh, we create a URL and a path for ourselves and when we choose save then we will save it over that URL and path by help of this and video and uh, after that this video will uh, you know uh, alert uh, to the user by this message successfully uh, recorded or failed 
and then present it and this means that we done saving that I'll, I'll show you again in the camera footage this time you may get better idea and uh, for yeah you will see that I have this too I'll show you how it will work at least a over simulator and uh, for this one uh, for play it's much easier we just uh, pick up video and image re review that we made variable top uh, at the beginning of the project and then we'll say okay source type will be save photo library so from photo library delegate self type only movie uh, so present it present it and then we done after we done we will close it and then we will come here to and say dismiss that one that's it this is all we do recording and play this is uh, one project that we have bought and working with the latest uh, iOS and Swift version Swift 4 and iOS 11 so let's go here and try to record say camera not available okay I'll show you on the real device uh, the movie I recorded and for play it will take you to uh, library but there is no library there is no actually uh, photo or video there so um, I can't I don't have anything to show you here you can even copy some movie there and show it okay so let's go and uh, look at our footage that we did so here you will see if we tap on record we will have this interface ready interface if you have zoom whatever you need and now I start to recording and we can zoom and uh, you know in and out if you want to, when you're done, uh, you can retake, you retake it or use it. When you uh, use it, it will save it there, and then you can with uh, a play video, you will see that we can review it. So let me just uh, come back here. So here we stop it. So we have your interface like this. We can review it and we can play it, or we can say use it with this video. So it's gonna save it or retake and retake it. So we're gonna uh, choose uh, use. So it will save it there, and then now uh, I pick up from the library again, and here you will see that we reviewed. Okay, so this is uh, all for today. I hope you like the video. If you like it, please make sure to give it thumbs up to be more uh, available for folks looking for this uh, important subject. And also, don't forget to subscribe for receiving, actually uh, being aware of new video which are coming every day. And thank you for watching us. Any question, please ask in comment. I wish the best for you and have a good one. Bye-bye.